Hello everybody, what's going on? If you want the players in your Fortnite creative to experience this right here, then this is the tutorial for you and you can just stop it by pressing a button and then your FPS goes back up. As simple as that, so let's go ahead and hop right into the tour tutorial. <laughs> guys so for you visual learners this is kind of what it looks like um but all you're gonna do is what i do is i lead a ramp that goes out of the map so that the swords will disappear and it won't take up memory so all you're gonna want to do is go to the edge of the map if you want to do it like that kind of build a cone like that and then you just want to do one of these looks just like this and then you're going to want to go ahead and put swords above it so that they fall down into there and then uh we'll go over the settings as well so you're going to want to grab an item granter right here you're going to want to grab an item granter throw this on the floor and then you're going to want to grab weapon you're going to want to grab the infinity blade and then you're just going to want to go ahead and drop it right in there and then we're going to go to custom we're going to go time before first spawn instant time between spawns instant invisible in game that's up to you um ch 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 item visibility up to you um enable on game start and no continuously spawn items on and then enable when receiving from we're gonna go ahead and use channel 15 because um all my other channels are um being used right now and then what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to turn it upside down and you're just gonna want to place them all over all over this like cone area um, mine are organized obviously because I had time to do it and you just want to place them all over that cone area to where they're going to fall down to the center and then you're going to want to go ahead and take a button or a trigger um, from devices button right here and then all you have to do is go over to channels and when interacted with transmit on channel 15 it's literally as easy as that um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you what it will look like alright so here we are guys our button on channel 15 and then all our swords and as soon as you press the button it's going to look like this And it's up to you, it's up to you if you want to add a stop button, but this is basically what they're going to experience, um, super simple, um, but yeah, mine's just a lot bigger, so it's going to last longer, you see how they just drop, and then all you got to do is go back up to it, and then you see what I mean by um, why we put that funnel there, because all those swords just dropped outside of the map, and now they're not in our map anymore, taking up our storage, and then all you got to do is press that button again, oh, it's not working right now, but because all the swords are on top of each other but if you lay them out like these ones up here where none of them are on top of each other then um your map will do uh, perfectly fine i'm on controller right now guys so sorry for being trash but yeah you lay them all out evenly that will not happen you'll just be able to press the button over and over and over again but if this did help how to drop fps how to make players games like in your creative map drop a like drop a sub for more creative tutorials I'm building an insane Gucci map right now, um, so if you want that, or if you want to get that early, like, you know, first day it comes out, turn the notifications on. Um, sorry, I'm really bad at tutorials, so I do a lot of talking. This will probably be, like, a four-minute video, but peace out if this did help. Um, you're welcome, and see you on the next one. Yeah, they can't hold us back, we on another level. Yeah, it's that new age, ain't it something special? Yeah, we gon' change the 